discussed uh, ingestion molding okay then the working principle of uh, ingestion molding the principle of ingestion molding is very very simple right the plastic material is heated uh, above its uh, melting point uh, resulting in the conversion of the solid polymer to a molten fluid with a reasonably uh, in low viscosity right it is uh, then forced into the closed mold that it defines the shape of the article to be produced clamping ingestion welding cooling uh, mold uh, opening and removal of uh, products types of uh, ingestion molding we have uh, various types of ingestion molding first one is cube molding second one is die casting third one is gas assisted ingestion molding fourth one is liquid silicon rubber uh, ingestion molding and uh, then metal injection molding then micro injection molding and uh, reaction injection molding final one is uh, thin wall uh, injection molding stages uh, these are the stages in uh, injection molding first one is uh, clamping then uh, injection and uh, cooling final one is uh, ejection product uh, for which type of uh, product uh, we can make by using uh, this method uh, we can make uh, plastic bottles uh, lists and caps uh, toys and uh, computers uh, kitchenware electronic housing and uh, electronic switches and plastic furnitures these are the various products we can make uh, by using this uh, method. What are the advantages by using this uh, method? First one is uh, precision. It will be high, the product will be very high precision and heat repeatability and low cost per uh, part. The cost will be very low and fast the uh, we can make this product very fastly mm, and uh, material choice uh, we can choose uh, various types of material in this method and uh, special surface finishes and uh, engraving and uh, printing then uh, little plastic uh, waste uh, waste material will be very low by using this uh, method disadvantages a uh, high initial cost the investment cost will be very high and uh, initial at time and uh, large part size uh, limitations careful design needed these are the disadvantages of this method blow molding Blow molding is the uh, forming of a hollow object by uh, inflating or uh, blowing a thermocouple molten tube called a uh, parison in the shape of uh, a mold cavity. The process, uh, this process consists of uh, extruding or uh, dropping a person on which a female mold uh, uh, hall uh, are closed. The female mold halls contain the shape of the product to be produced. Here uh, we can understand very clearly in this uh, from this uh, figure the uh, resin copper is shown on the right side and uh, uh, left side programming uh, accumulator head 
and uh, mold uh, blow pin uh, stand right extruder the material raw material is passed through this uh, hopper and uh, the extruder is uh, transforming from uh, hopper to accumulator and uh, the material uh, is uh, uh, mold by using some heating unit okay finally if you are injecting finally we can get five safe